Hey guys, how's everyone doing today? Welcome to the vlog, by the way. Um, basically, what we are doing today is we are going shopping, but not for much. We don't got much money, but we are doing that. And then I'm going to go in GNC to see if they have some uh, casein protein, casein slow digesting protein, take before you go to bed. You guys don't want to hear my bodybuilding lingo. But um, we're doing that. Uh, my mom's in the bank right now, actually, so we're here at the bank. We're using my brother's wife's car, uh, and she's the one at the end of the video, you know, at the end of my vlog, where it says, and family, and then it shows me, and there goes the radio, and then it shows me, my brother, and his wife, so that's her, so we are using her car, it's a, um, Honda, what is it, Honda something. Hmm. It's a Honda. And I'm not I'm not big into Japanese cars. I'm not a rice burner person. I'm an American muscle car person. But I gotta say, for as small as it is, it is super roomy and a amazingly smooth ride. And it and it just looks really cool. See look, that's the speedometer right there, and over here it tells you you know, outside degrees, 14 degrees outside. Um uh, just a just a great car. And I've been listening to my iPod on it. I got my protein mix here for later on. I got some macadamia nuts and almonds in here. And cashews, not almonds. Got them in there for a snack. So that's what I've been doing, guys. How's everybody's day going so far? I hope it's going good. Hope you guys have been enjoying my last few vlogs I did. And here's the gum. I have been talking about, uh, yesterday I talked about it, the, uh, strawberry and banana gum, extra, right there. Uh, so, that's about what we're gonna be doing today, so go to the store, uh, go to GNC, and then we gotta meet my mom's friend, and she is, and, yeah, my mom's friend is, uh, fixing up the car for her, so we have to give him a little bit of money fix up the car and hopefully we'll have the car back soon um so yeah but but it's been really fun taking my brother's truck and uh my brother's wife's car i don't know it's just it's just cooler than taking around the same old chevy and pala <laughs> but yeah guys so i'll see you guys in a bit hey guys um i left you guys in payless shoes uh we were heading outside i'm out of breath because i ran a payless we were outside, and I was checking my pockets on uh, to go out before we went outside because I thought, "Hey, where's my iPod?" But then I thought I might have left it uh, like in the car, so I wouldn't be able to vlog. And I was like, "Oh, that sucks! I won't be able to vlog it in the car." So I uh, I go outside to the car, and it's not on the floor. It's not attached to the radio. I'm like, "Oh my God, my iPod! It's gone." And I got this for Christmas, and it was really expensive. So, no, my mom's like, where'd you put it, where'd you put it? I'm like, I don't know, GNC, because I went to GNC and bought two things of protein. And I'll talk about that later, because that's not as important as this. But, um, so, I'm like, wait, pay less. So, I ran a pay less. Like, literally, I ran. And, uh, good thing I'm doing a lot of cardio, right? Because then I can run fast. So, I went there, and there it was on the bench. Thank God we're in a deserted mall. See, this is like the most deserted mall in our area. No one's ever here. So, thank God that there's not a lot of people here because this would have been gone in a second. So, God bless me. Thank you, God. Hey guys, we're in Walmart now. I promise I won't lose you guys this time. I promise. <clears throat> Just looking for ice cream for my next cheat day, which is probably this Sunday. So, just looking around. For my next cheat day, <clears throat> my voice is going out. I don't know why, but um, it's uh, I'm trying to find some ice cream. They got Ben and Jerry out there, but it's not the kind that I'm looking for. So I'm looking for some Ben and Jerry. There's Ben and Jerry. Hmm. 
we got a lot of different ice cream in here. I don't want to go too overboard this time with my cheat day because I gained so much weight from the last one. So I think I'm just going to go with something like lower fat <clears throat> if we can find it. So let's look. I don't want ice pops. Let's see. There's mint. might be good because that's what I'm looking for it's frozen yogurt so it's healthier I mean it's not exactly the healthiest but healthier so let's look at this here In half a cup no no no, no, no. How dare they put Ben and Jerry with Hagen dazs How dare they? Ben and Jerry's pones Hagen dazs all day. And I'm saying that, and I'm German, and Hagen dazs is German, I think. So it took me about 20 minutes to look in the ice cream section. I didn't even get anything. Is that a little ridiculous? But, um, so anyways. I am just over here in the tea and coffee section, just looking around, and they have this thing called Stoke, right here. Just what everybody needs, adding more caffeine to your cup of coffee. But anyways, so what I did get, I got some cookies and some Cheetos for my cheat day. So my mom's gonna put them away, hide them. Gotta hide them, because you know, us big people, we can find stuff easy. So my mom hides it, but she always dips into it. <laughs> hey guys, we're home. Uh, to show you guys what we got at Walmart since I couldn't. I bought this here Italian sweet cream, and I use that for my green tea. And I just drank some green tea. I do drink decaf. Um, I'm a little worried, however. Um, if any of you guys are health nuts out there, can you answer this question for me, please? Um, there is tea there. I'd like to start drinking regular to get me more of an energy boost. So that'd be like 25 to 50 milligrams of caffeine in regular green tea. Would that hurt me at all? You know, I'm 16 years old and a bodybuilder. So would it be better to, to go decaf like I am? Or would it be better to just get regular? Help me out, you health nuts. But anyways, my mom made chile. I'm not eating any, though, because I'm low-carbing it today. And I got my... She got new shoes. They're not in here right now. I got organic carrots and stuff, and my hot habanero mustard. And my new uh, protein. I bought today in GNC. Got this as a, at a great deal, actually. $18.00. For delicious strawberry, two pounds of whey protein. I take Optimum Nutrition as a meal replacement, and then I take Betancourt as my post workout. Um, gotta tell you guys right now, those are the only two brands I trust. Only two. Only two brands in the whole bodybuilding industry I trust, and that's Betancourt and Optimum Nutrition. So, with that delicious strawberry, I also got chocolate malt, and that's the same thing. Speaking of chocolate malt, uh, Rita's, I don't know if you guys have Rita's around where you live, Rita's Ice Cream, Rita's Custard, they're opening March 3rd, so I can't wait for that either. But let's see what's in the fridge here. So what did we get? 
We got ragu. We got blueberries. We got salsa. We got flat out bread. You guys ever see this? Flat out bread. Only a hundred calories here. I mean, no, I don't know how to put that back in with one hand. But anyways, uh, Greek yogurt, vanilla, cottage cheese. Eat that before I go to sleep for casein protein. And then we got more eggs from the Amish here. Uh, we got some turkey in there. Don't think we got anything for the freezer. Nope, nothing for the freezer. Got some lemons. Um, got some mayo. Got some mayo there. Light mayonnaise. Uh, no salt cashews. God, this is GNC also. Oatmeal protein bar deluxe. I'll eat that tomorrow and I'll show you guys my reaction to it. Haven't ate it yet. I'm gonna eat it tomorrow for a pre-workout. It's, spo it's supposed to have like fiber and stuff and all that good stuff in it. So hey, what the heck. Uh, my brother gave me his old Atlanta Braves hat. Because I always wear this hat. Uh, he gives me all the hats. <laughs> Um, I'm starting to wear hats again, so, you know, it's really cool that my brother's helping me out. So that's what my supplement stack looks like now. Pretty good, isn't it, guys? And then there's my macadamias. I got two new magazines, by the way, for the wrestling fans. I got the WWE magazine. Came with a beanie. That's basically why I got it. I don't think I'm going to open it. I think I'm going to leave it in there. But WrestleMania beanie in here. And then I got men's health in here. All that good stuff. Oh, lose your gut. Hmm. So that's what's going on here. Alright guys, so I'm getting ready to make my uh, fourth meal for today. It's, um, it's a bodybuilding recipe here. Found it online, so I'm just going to show you guys how to do it. So, uh, here it is. So you're going to use ground turkey breast. Now, I am basically cutting weight, so that's why I'm using turkey. You can use chicken, and if you're uh, bulking up, you could even use red meat. That'd be just, you know, the normal thing to do would be to use red meat, but I'm using white meat, 99, 1, turkey, uh, some chili powder, cayenne pepper, garlic powder, and salsa. Now, you don't need the seasonings. That's just basically optional. Uh, the salsa is optional also, but I find that it gives it more of a taco flavor. And I'm using flat out healthy grain, multi-grain with flaxseed uh, bread, flat bread. Uh, 100 calories, 8 net carbs. 1 gram sugar, 31% of your fiber, and has 8 grams of fiber in it. And some fat-free cheddar cheese. So, that's all you need, really. Alright guys, so I just got done eating my fourth meal, the taco. And, um, that's about it for today, guys. Short vlog, kind of shortish. So, um, let's think of a comment question here. You know, what I've always um, noticed is that whenever I'm saying goodbye to you guys, I'm always in the kitchen. I don't know why. I guess because it has the best lighting in the whole house is the kitchen. And I also noticed, and I said this in my one of my other videos, but every time I'm going out, like, saying goodbye to you guys, the Joker hair. Every. Single. Time. I don't think there's been a video where I didn't have the Joker hair going on. So, that's pretty funny. So let me uh, think of a comment question for you guys. Hmm. Hmm. I got it. Follow me.
Let there be light. All right. So let's turn off the TV. Sit in the chair here. Lend. Let's see. What is your favorite old school cartoon? I was just on Netflix looking. I typed in Nickelodeon. And they got SpongeBob. They got Rugrats. They got Rocco, which is awesome. Gonna watch Rocco later, I think. And Ah Real Monsters. Ah Real Monsters was awesome. Rocco was awesome. SpongeBob is still actually awesome. And Rugrats is awesome. And I believe they have. Let me check here. And then they also have Beavis and Butthead. My all time favorite cartoon, like, um, cartoon, like, as in childhood cartoon, um, that's tough. I guess anything 90s Nickelodeon would do it for me. Anything from the 90s of Nickelodeon. Those were the best years of TV, of all of TV. Wrestling was awesome. You know, you had The Rock, Stone Cold, The Hardy Boys, um, Nickelodeon, awesome. You know, you had The Angry Beavers, Ren and Stimpy, um, Kablam, uh, uh, Slime Time Live. Uh, let's see. And then MTV was awesome. You actually had real music on there, you know, um... You know, there wasn't Jersey Shore uh, or anything like that. You know, you had Beavis and Butthead on there. And, like, uh, live performances. Um, Saturday Night Live was awesome. Mad TV was awesome. So, yeah, 90s were the best, I think so. So, comment question to you guys is, what's your favorite old school cartoon from your day? Doesn't matter, hey, if you were born back sooner uh tom and jerry you know that kind of stuff but what is your favorite cartoon from your day leave me a comment below guys talk to you guys tomorrow